I classify you as one of the busiest bulls on the men's soccer team. You've played in 41 games in the past two years since you, you came to USF. How's your experience has been going and, and uh, how excited are you for the new season? Pretty great, man. I'm excited to play another season with the USF. Um, the most thing I'm excited about is uh, the new guys who are coming in, actually. We're having a lot of class, a lot of people coming in, new guys. That's what I'm mostly excited about. And, and every year you, you seem to get a, a lot of new guys from a lot of different countries. A, a few years back, you were, you were one of the, the people that came from South Africa. Um, how, how do you guys get, you know, now that you're a veteran with the team, how do you get everybody to kind of mold in, you know, the new guys that come from, from different places that are just here for the first time sometimes in this country? Being, another, being a person from another country, how do you get these, these guys to feel comfortable and, and kind of mesh with the team? Like, it's, like, if you're from another country, like, everything like we do is, like, play, play soccer. And, like, if you play soccer every day, you know, like, what everybody's like, and then you know what everybody does every day and stuff like that. So it's kind of easy if you're from another country, because that's what you do every day. It's, like, the same lifestyle. So it's, it's kind of easy, and then when you go out, outside soccer, and then it's just, like, yeah, best friend, man. It's easy. Soccer makes it easy for everybody. How comfortable are you with soccer right now? I mean, two years under your belt, you know, you played in pretty much every game. Um, how comfortable are you going into the next season? I'm not too comfortable, actually. It's, it's going to be tough because I know we're going to have like a long season. We have like top schedule this year. And then uh, I just want to play my best and hope the team does well. That's all I'm looking forward to. That's great that you're staying hungry. You know, going back to last year, you finished second on the team um, in points and, and you had a lot of assists and you had a lot of key goals. I mean, what did you think of your year and, and what did you learn about yourself in such a big year for you? Last year I was hurt most of it, so I don't know, I don't think like I gave 100% most of it, but like it ended up uh, turned out good towards the end because I was getting my fitness back and then my injury was going away and stuff like that. So it was fine towards the end. So right now, I'm just going to be healthy and make sure it's that the season healthy. That's all I'm looking forward to because my ankle right now is bothering me too. So I just, I'm just doing rehab and then I hope everything is good by the preseason. <laughs> What's the feeling like going into a game with all those fans out there, you know, walking down the berm and, you know, when you guys win like that, and just how, how special of an experience is it over here? It's the best, man. It's the best. We win, like, on the road, and then it's just not the same. You win in the road, it's like, okay, we won. But if we win at COVID, man, it's just great feeling. And then you look at everybody in the atmosphere, it's just great, man, unbelievable. And we get, like, a lot of fans, too. It's just, it's just great. I can't even explain it.